hi everyone welcome to my channel today i want to share with you this super easy uh, flower or star shell uh, it's for spring i think i like it very much you can use that pattern every project i want to make a, a scarf or a rectangle shawl which you want you can make it it's so simple only four row repeating uh, so easy you can keep crocheting easily i made this shawl with 56 chains and it's equal to width is 30 centimeter if you want to make it more wider you can add five 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 okay it's multiples of five plus one only one time uh, i use cake yarn in that shawl i will use with that four millimeter hook my uh, hooks brand is tulip i use that you can choose different yarns for that and i want to show you how can you do that it's so simple i promise if you're ready and also don't forget subscribe to my channel we start to crochet our flower or star shawl let's start to crochet we start with first slip knot then make your shawl which size you want make multiples of five one two three four five I want to make a sample now so I made here 35 chains plus one only one time okay if you want to get your shawl more wider you will add five chains always per five chains yarn over twice and not count your uh, loop on your hook start from here one two three four five skip insert into the sixth one grab your yarn pull through two pull through two this chain five is your first triple for your edges okay I have two loops on my hook pull uh, yarn over twice and insert into the same stitch grab your yarn pull through two pull through two I have three loops on my hook I close them together yarn over twice again always we will uh, work with yarn over twice skip one two three and four insert into the fifth one grab your yarn pull through two pull through two yarn over twice insert into the same stitch grab your yarn pull through two pull through two i have three loops pull through all together chain four one two three four yarn over twice insert into the same stitch and make a cluster triple cluster again pull through two pull through two yarn over twice insert into the same stitch grab your yarn pull through two pull through two i have three loops pull through all together we make v stitch with uh, triple clusters between of them four chains yarn over twice again and skip four one two three four insert into the fifth one grab your yarn pull through two pull through two yarn over twice insert into the same stitch grab your yarn pull through two pull through two i have three loops pull through all together then chain four one two three four yarn over twice insert into the same stitch again grab your yarn pull through two pull through two yarn over twice insert into the same stitch grab your yarn pull through two pull through two i have three loops pull through all together i made my second triple uh, clusters v yarn over twice and not make any chains and skip four one two three four insert into the fifth one grab my yarn pull through two pull through two yarn over twice insert into the same grab my yarn pull through two pull through two i have three loops pull through all together 
then chain four and do it again i come to end this is our first row i come to end of this row i will turn to i come to end yarn over twice and skip four here again one two three four insert into the fifth one one two three four five grab my yarn pull through two pull through two yarn over twice insert into the same and make pull through two pull through two i have three loops pull through all together you remember we start this row with a, a, a cluster not make a v half here so we finish with this row with cluster and yarn over twice insert into the last stitch here and make a triple because our chain five is our first triple this is our first row now we are on the second row chain one and turn my work count as that first stitch here insert into the second one grab my yarn and make a slip stitch insert into the next grab my yarn and make one more slip stitch i make here two slip stitch then chain four one two three four skip these four chains insert into that stitch grab my yarn and make a slip stitch insert into the next grab my yarn and make a slip stitch then chain four again one two three four skip these four chains insert into that stitch grab my yarn make a slip stitch insert into the next make a slip stitch chain four one two three four skip these four insert into the stitch one and make one more slip stitch totally two slip stitch we made one two three four make a slip stitch make one more slip stitch one two three four come to end make here two slip stitch one and two you remember we make here first chain one and count the first single crochet so i insert into the last stitch here grab my yarn and make a single crochet and finish the second row now chain five two three four five and turn my work we are on the third row you can see here this row holds here because we slide this um, flowers place one is here one is here you can see that we do that like that we start with that a cluster here so we will make this space a v stitch yarn over twice insert into that space grab my yarn pull through two pull through two yarn over twice insert into the same pull through two pull through two i have three loops pull through all together chain four three four yarn over twice insert into the same hole grab my yarn pull through two pull through two yarn over twice insert into the same pull through two pull through two pull through all together yarn over twice and skip this four and you can see here be called between of that two v here i insert my hook here grab my yarn pull through two pull through two yarn over twice insert into the same grab my yarn pull through two pull through two i have three loops pull through all together chain four two three four yarn over twice 
insert into the same space one and two yarn over twice and make one more one and two I have three loops pull through all together you can see we complete these flowers or stars which you want to say yarn over twice skip this four and come to between of that V here be called insert my hook here and make here a cluster pull through to pull through to yarn over twice insert into same pull through to pull through to I have three loops pull through all together chain four yarn over twice insert into the same pull through to pull through to yarn over twice insert into the same pull through to pull through to I have three loops pull through all together yarn over twice and come to that space and make a V again with clusters then come here and make a V I come to end and turn to you I come to end yarn over twice and you remember we start with V stitch so we finish here with V stitch insert into that that cluster and that V stitch here is the place hole is ready pull through to pull through to yarn over twice insert into the same pull through to pull through to I have three loops pull through all together then chain four three four yarn over twice insert into the same and make one more cluster pull through all together and yarn over twice my last stitch is make a triple on that single crochet one two three this is the end of third row on the fourth row is a same chain one and turn this time you can see here one stitch and make one slip stitch from starting chain four one two three four and come to skip here and come to that stitch and make a slip stitch one and two chain four two three four skip this four come to stitch and make here one and two slip stitch one two three four skip this four insert into stitch and make a slip stitch and make one more slip stitch one two three four skip these four chains and make here two slip stitch one and two one two three four one and two one two three four come here and you have here one stitch make a slip stitch this fourth row only one difference from that second row uh, second row when you start with chain one uh, start with two slip stitch on the fourth row start with uh, one slip stitch because uh, we slide this uh, clusters these place okay and finish the last stitch with a single crochet then turn back to the first row like that chain five one two three four five count as the first triple and turn your work this is at the end of the fourth row now we look at here and you can see we start uh, the first row with a cluster so we have here a big hole and a place yarn over twice and insert into that place grab my yarn pull through to pull through to yarn over twice insert into the same grab my yarn pull through to pull through to I have three loops pull through all together do the same thing here yarn over twice and skip this four and come to between of that V stitch clusters here you can see here because I insert here grab my yarn 
pull through to, pull through to. Yarn over twice, insert into the same. Pull through to, pull through to. I have three loops, pull through all together. Chain four. Yarn over twice, insert into the same. Pull through to, pull through to. Yarn over twice, insert into the same. Pull through to, pull through to. I have three loops, pull through all together. Then skip this four and you can see here big hole and insert your hook from here and make a cluster, chain four and make one more cluster in the same space, the same as the first row. Then skip these and come here and make a clusters V here. Skip here, come here. Then repeat the second row, repeat the third row, repeat the fourth row. One row you start with a cluster, one row you will start a clusters V. And always be careful about that uh, holes. Uh, it tells you uh, which place you will insert your hook. Okay, only uh, look at it carefully. Okay, it's so simple. I hope you like it and you will try. It's so... Uh, simple and fast crocheting and so funny it's growing up easily i hope you will try if you have any questions please leave me comments and also don't forget subscribe to my channel you can reach me on facebook on pinterest on instagram and on etsy as the same name crochet with gigi hope to see you in new videos have a nice day bye bye